Hello guys, this is Dar from Finbullet.com. Today I'm going to show you how to add portfolio item to your blog or website. Uh, it's uh, it's um, slightly different than the last one I showed you, how to add slideshow to the blog post. The, the main idea, um, the main difference is uh, that uh, uh, blog post slideshow will show up uh, in the post list and it will show up your images as a um, uh, as a slideshow however uh, it will not have so many features and uh, you cannot actually you can but it's not going to look like uh, look the same as portfolio item uh, whereas portfolio item is dedicated for um, offers for the creators uh, when you want to showcase your work so it's suitable for designers for I don't know bloggers for uh, photographers and uh, you can stretch it to the full width instead of you know showing it uh, uh, on or you can keep it totally separate or let's say if you want to create a portfolio site rather than a blog then this is the idea you should use uh, a portfolio slash gallery uh, custom post built into our themes so I'm going to use signature as an example uh, again and uh, let's start so normally you should be uh, logging to your dashboard I'm logging to, to mine so uh, if you look at the main menu in dashboard, you will have uh, uh, gallery options. In some themes, it may be called portfolio. Um, uh, in angle, for example. Uh, so, if you click on gallery, it will show the list of uh, portfolio item already created there. Obviously, if there's uh, if, if you haven't done it yet, there will be nothing uh, to see there. So, click on add new and select uh, format. Uh, you have five formats uh, to choose from. Image, slideshow, grid gallery, video and audio. I'm going to cover slideshow, uh, slideshow in this case, uh, in this video. So let's say, uh, let's call it portfolio. I know it's not uh, hugely creative but just I can't think uh, about any title at the moment. And let's create category. So uh, let's create Category. I call it photography. So, alright. Add category, assign it to this category automatically. This is the main uh, um, uh, field where you can add your description. So, portfolio description goes here. Specific for this item. So, uh, for this item. So, the, you put it whatever you want. It is totally optional, so if you, you can leave it blank if you like. If you want to keep things uh, clean and minimal without any extra information. Uh, if you scroll down, you will see a couple additional options. Date, client, info, URL. These are also optional. Or you can enable lightbox or disable. So, um, uh, it's, um, so generally... Uh, that's it and now we need to add our photos obviously and some, some images to our portfolio so you need to click on upload files and you need to keep um, uh, you need to remember about the fact that the images should be uploaded to your um, portfolio item whenever you're choosing slideshow or is it going to be grid gallery uh, you need to upload them to the server so they can be processed by the script so they can be cropped uh, accordingly to the uh, theme requirements and uh, uh, be processed and shown up as slideshow automatically. So the main idea is to just uh, upload them to the file and so they can be attached to this custom post. So select. I'm going to select a couple of photos here. Let's say uh, Thailand is good, Myanmar is good, just uh, Tatra Mountains is good. Let's say let's start with free. You can uh, hold Control Command uh, uh, to multiple select. Okay, they upload it to the post now. D uh, you don't need to click on um, on the button. Click the button Insert in into page because this will actually insert the images, uh, uh, those images uh, into the post content. We don't want that. We want to keep them separately, show up as slideshow, not 
as uh, you know in generic way like, as WordPress does it. WordPress does it. So generally, you just close this window. Once you're done, you click publish. And voila, we have our portfolio uh, item created, uh, slideshow. In this example, slideshow. But uh, as you can see, if you go to your uh, frontend, your blog website, it's not going to show up here. This is the post uh, we created in the last tutorial. Uh, this is slideshow post. I don't know why it's loading so um, so slow. To my local ho um, uh, host, so it's, yeah. So so generally, uh, it doesn't show up here. So you need to add them somewhere. As I said previously, um, these are totally separate uh, posts, custom posts. So in order to add a portfolio item, you just go to appearance, menus. Select the menu you want. I'm going to use uh, the main menu, top menu, and I'm going to add this uh, to the uh, this portfolio to the uh, to the menu. However, if you look on the left hand side, when we have a list of our um, uh, uh, items we can add, uh, there's no gallery options. So you need to go to screen options and just click on gallery. It might be called portfolio. And that's it. Now, once it's added, it, it shows up here. Just add it to, to menu. And now we have your portfolio. I, I've called it portfolio one, but you know, obviously you can use your own label. You can use portfolio or, I don't know, photography portfolio or my photos, whatever you want. Uh, and then save it. It will show up now. Um, okay, you see it shows up my photos page. A separate page. Okay, so now once we're done, uh, as you can see, the Myanmar is first photo. I, I'm gonna show you how to change the order because you might want to change your mind and once you add more photos you want to want to decide about ordering a, a little bit more so go to your galleries and then edit it and then you need to open media panel go to add media this will open up my media panel and now in media panel you will have uh, more photos obviously in time you build up your blog website whatever it's gonna be more and more it will be more confusing you need to change change order uh, for only for those uh, images so you need to see the images attached to this particular custom post so click on upload it to this page and now you see those so if you drag them around let's say I want to see Tatra Mountains. Okay, and Tatra Mountains is first. Then is uh, um, Thailand, and there is uh, Myanmar. So if you go there, see uploaded. The, but this uh, order. If you want to have a Thailand, then go drag it over, and you have Thailand first. Okay. What if you want to add uh, at later time? If you wanna add, uh, let's say, it's portfolio photography, and you add it more, uh, you wanna create, let's say, album. So you need to add more photos. So go to add media. You select upload to this image so you'll see what, what's going on how many you have all together uh, and uh, you don't need to do that actually and then you you can upload uh, new images let's say I'm going to upload this winter scene here okay and just close this media panel update post and now I will have four images. Okay, 
and what if you want to uh, remove some images then go to your media library again within the posts and click upload it to this page and just just click select the image you want to remove and click delete perman permanently uh, be aware that it's going to uh, um, delete the, the image permanently from the server so uh, keep in mind that you need to keep it handy somewhere on your uh, hard drive if you wanna use it later on yeah and that just update and that's it simple as that so generally you know how to add, so how to create a portfolio item a slideshow. In next series I'm going to show you how to create a different type of portfolio uh, posts or how to uh, build a uh, um, uh, little bit bigger portfolio uh, pages with some filterable options. Uh, and then uh, hopefully it's gonna uh, it's gonna help you to build something awesome. Uh, hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching, and uh, see you next time.